Good morning and happy Saturday. We're kicking off our Labor Day weekend with lots of dry air aloft. Here's a look at it on water vapor. That orange color is dry air. That's what's gonna keep skies very sunny today. That's also what has brought our temperatures down into the upper 40s in Dent County this morning, closer to around 60 to kick off the day in Springfield. By this afternoon, highs approaching 90 degrees in some areas, mainly off to the west. We will be in the 90s area wide starting tomorrow and Monday with higher moisture levels expected, which could trigger a couple of showers and storms Monday afternoon and evening. I will say most of the activity stays off to the south and east of Springfield. However, heading into Monday evening, uh, most of those showers and storms die down. Now, I think we could get a shower or storm in the Branson or Springfield area. Mainly off to the east is where we're seeing these higher chances, but off to the west a little bit drier. Here's a look at your weather headlines, expecting a warm up into this next week. Rain chances increase starting Monday and lasting us through the rest of the work week. We're expecting higher humidity levels as well. That's because our dew point, a measure of moisture in the lowest parts of our atmosphere, that's gonna be nearing the 70s this week. So each afternoon, expect that feels like temperature to be hotter than it actually is. But here's what could play a role in some cooler temperatures in a few areas. That's gonna be the rain chances. On Tuesday, we're looking at some scattered showers and storms possible. Literally every day this week, there is a chance for some storms. So uh, expect those high temperatures to maybe change a little bit depending on the area that you're in and how much rain is expected. These are going to be several upper level disturbances. So some changes are likely within this forecast. Make sure you're tuning in frequently for the latest details as we learn more about each of these disturbances. But here's a breakdown day by day. I will say Monday, it's looking mainly off to the east, but a little bit more uh, widely scattered across the area Tuesday through Friday. And then we're looking at cooler conditions and drier conditions starting Saturday of this next week.